To all who come to this happy place, welcome. Howdy, 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 Diz Jabbers. It's Wednesday, July the 17th, and we are here at Magic Kingdom for a very special day. Two things going on today. Number one, Sophia is getting her makeover, princess makeover, at Bippity Boppity Boutique. Which princess do you think she chose to be today, I wonder? She wonders. She actually knows. We both know. You probably know. know, too. That's a good one. The other part is going to be us in the Magic Kingdom doing some cool stuff. Me, well, I don't know if anybody else is going to join me, eating at Columbia Harbor House for lunch to have my tuna sandwich. The best tuna sandwich in God's green earth. Best tuna sandwich. It's not that I don't like Columbia Harbor House. I'm just not a fan of fish in general. All right, she doesn't like fish. So Dory and Nemo. No, Sorry, guys. Like She's not a fan. Because of not Dory a fan. And Nemo. It's a whole thing. Anyway, now it's time to head through security. No, I'm not calling security, sir. No, I didn't need you. No, I'm just kidding. So now it's time to head through security and then go through the. Uh, Bing bing! I got my special magic band, Mickey Through the Years. That one is so cool, it's so colorful and great. And then we're going to see some awesome things from Magic Kingdom today. Maybe get on a little pirates. Arr! There's pirates in these waters. Right, so? Where's so? Oh, wow. Sophie is already bing gone to the castle. She got out of her stroller. She said, Mom, I could do this. Pushed Mom away and started pushing the stroller herself. That ah, didn't really happen. But it would be awesome if it did. We are going to make our way into the kingdom. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. But as you all know, Magic Kingdom, we coming for you. So here is our sight as we're walking up to security. Yes, it is going to be a little bit crowded today. Normally, mornings like this, beautiful morning, nice and warm. Nah, it's not nice and warm, but what am I going to do, right? You will normally see crowds like this at security. And once you get through security, it loosens up a little bit, widens out. And then you deal with the turnstile, which isn't as bad. Oh, all bags to your left. All right. Then we head through, go to Main Street Station, go under it. So let's get through this and pick it up right from where we left off. So here we are on Main Street, making our way up to Cinderella's Castle. Today's going to be very exciting for one special reason. Let me tell you what it is. I am going to be meeting Gaston. He's one of my idols. He's one of my heroes. He is my favorite villain so Jafar comes in a close second but nobody beats Gaston so <laughs> oh you gotta love families on vacation all right so I'm wearing my Gaston shirt going to head over there in a few minutes so exciting because no one meets like Gaston no one Eats like Gaston. I get to meet him and then have my shirt feat. on. Wait, what? What a great feat. What a, uh, what a great feat. All I know is that I'm no singer. What I do know is he has always been one of my favorites. And TT over here is wearing a bell bow in her hair. So we might get some decent interaction from Gaston today. Because Belle is my favorite princess because she loves to read just like me. She does. She loves to read just like her. Like that. Like this. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm going to taste a few the things. Maybe out. the trolley's out. Let's see what's happening up there. I'm 
gonna hop in front of the castle quick for a picture. Get TT for her picture. And then we'll find where Sam, oh wow, Sam and Matt are gone. I see them up in the castle practically already. No way I'm catching them yet. There goes Sam right now, it's so crazy. She's blind aggression with speed. Okay, so we're heading into the middle of the castle and we're going to sneak in and see Princess Cinderella. We're not really gonna see Cinderella, but I like to pretend sometimes. Just like I like to pretend that Muggsies don't follow us around. There were Muggsies on the bus this morning here. I couldn't believe it. You people, don't you ever learn? Bippity boppity boutique day for Sophia. She is going to get her princess makeover. And here she is, ready for her super princess makeover. No? Who are you going to choose today? What? What princess dress are you wearing? A bell. Bell? Oh, that's so exciting. Are you excited? Tell, so. tell all the Diz Jabbers how excited you are. I'm super excited. Super excited. All right. Oh, stop that. You don't want the Diz Jabbers to get scared. Look. Ooh. Okay. All right. So, are you giving the Diz Jabber sign? Give it to him. Did you see Princess Aurora's dress? Oh, and she's out. So, Sophie is waiting patiently. Sophie, look at Jay. Patiently, right? All right. Waiting so patiently to have her yes. makeover. So, is there anything you want to tell me? Oh, this Jack. All right. Oh, she's checking all the dresses. She's making sure it's all good. Okay, so during this vlog, you're going to see the inner workings of the Bippity Boppity Boutique. You're going to see the fairy godmothers in training making Sophie into a beautiful Cinderella's castle princess, a true Disney princess. Sophie, we all love you, and we hope you enjoy this more than you can possibly imagine, because I know we're going to. So, Sophia is now in the changing room, and she's getting into her new dress so she can start her fantastic makeover from Sophia to Princess Sophia. Wow, you look so pretty. What? So funny. Can you go? You want me to introduce you? Go back in so, she, so Jay can introduce you. Uh, yeah, we're going to do one. Introducing the newest Disney princess, Sophia. <laughs> you look so beautiful. Stand back. Can you do a spin? Wonderful. Do a little spin. Okay. Beautiful. All right. He needs the royal cashier. Yes. Let's find Sophia. I don't think we can find her. There she is! Beautiful. And Sophia is wearing a Disney made bell gown. Fresh from Walt Disney World. The dressmakers worked very hard in making this dress very special for Sophie. It is gorgeous, it is sparkly, it is floofy just like Sophie likes. So why don't we talk to a former fairy godmother in training and find out what's the next step? The hair. Oh, the hair. Where does this take place? Next door. In, in the, the castle. Ca <gasps> the castle's next. 
Sophie is very excited for her transition from peasant girl Sophia to beautiful princess Sophia. She's always our princess. But now she'll be a true Disney princess.
And that would be Peter Pan. That's the fast pass entrance? Okay, so our next fast pass is for Space Mountain. That ride is the tough one. We always go on it every year and come off it saying, never again, this thing rocked my life. I was shaken to the soul. Ah! But we're going on it. So that's our next fast pass, but we're gonna try and sneak a picture with Gaston first because I am wearing his shirt and I should get some pretty good interaction with him. If he's standing out here, which I hope he is, but I don't see him. So in 15 minutes, Gaston will be back out. So exciting. It's 12.15 now, 12.30, he'll be out. I'll get my little mano y mano with him, then head over to Space Mountain. Over here, we have Gaston's Tavern. Now Gaston's Tavern is pretty popular for his pork shank, the cinnamon bun in, that in the morning, I think it's bigger than your head, and LeFou's Brew, which I'm a fan of. Not many people like. It's got this marshmallowy apple juice. Uh, the marsh top's like marshmallow, like froth, and then apple juice under it, frozen, a frozen drink, mind you. I like it, I like it a lot. People compare it to the Harry Potter's um, butterbeer, but I don't think so. I think it's better. That's just my opinion. So I'm at the Gaston Fountain right now. God, it's hot out, by the way. And uh, it's right there behind me. I'm gonna get a picture with it in a few seconds, and then uh, we'll move on. Oh, that's cute. 
She's got the muscle. How about? I guess. I don't want to. I mean, you do me a favor. How about you start going there religiously, and then next time you come here, you may look behind you. That's really dumb. Yeah, it's really dumb. Do me a favor. A little imposter belt. Don't ruin his shirt. Do me a favor. Hold up your right bicep. Right bicep. Yeah. Flex it. Go ahead. And just because I know you want to, go ahead and squeeze that one. Out. Get it squeeze that one out. It's impressive, yeah? Uh-huh. I know. Uh -huh. So happy that you actually go to the gym. <laughs> Bye. 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 Mom. That's fine, thank you. Right. So you mom or no? No, man. That's I'm mom, okay. sorry. That's good. Works for me. Yep. So, Ants. I'm going to sign this for you. Oh, and does the little bell want a photo again? Or? Another photo? Not out of the way. Yes. Bye. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. Okay. Does that work? You're welcome. Smile. Got it. Okay. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Thank you. Bye. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> bye, girl. Come on, so. Come on, so. Say bye. Come on, so. Next. You know what? You know what? Right. All right. Oh my god, best interaction with Gaston ever. That was fantastic. He was cocky, he was stuck up, he was pompous, he was Gaston, exactly the way he should be. Amazing meet and greet. I'm gonna do it again next time. All right, so now we are heading over to Space Mountain. And on the way, I had to stop, it's hot out and I want something cold. So I stopped off at this little kiosk area, little food court stand, if you will, and got the witch's brew. The witch's brew, from what I read before the sweat just soaked into my eyeballs and burned them out, the witch's brew has Coca-Cola, frozen lemonade, fat passion fruit, I think, and a whole bunch of other stuff that I tried to see without squinting. Couldn't do it. So I'm gonna get a little description and I'll pop, pop it in there under this drink so that you can see what it's made of. It's got some pop rocks on the straw. This is so awesome. I can't wait to get a sip of this. Could it be better than the food brew? I think not, but you never know. Wow. I don't know what else to say about that. That's pretty good. Strong. I got a lot of that juice at the bottom. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to mix it up or not. Let me pull the straw up a little bit and get a little bit higher up, see what happens. Oh my God, much better. Probably needs to be mixed. Don't just suck from the bottom of the cup because you get a whole mouthful of that stuff and it's like, with a whole lot of ah and a little bit of ooh. overall good drink all right so sam's trying the witch's brew she mixed it i didn't mix it yet it's, it's good until like the end and there's like a little like there's some pop rocks on there too i'm not a fan of pop rocks that's why oh yeah that's why you don't like it sam because you're not a fan of pop rocks Who's not a fan of Pop Rocks? Oh. Anywho, Diz Jabbers, like always, the vlog was starting to get a little long. I don't want you to have to sit there for an hour through a vlog. I want you to be able to sit down and relax for 30 minutes, chill, watch the vlog, and then go about your business and come back about a week later, less than that. Watch the rest of it, just so you're anticipating what's going to happen. Is Diz Jabber 71 going to make it? Will they ride this ride? Will he spit at the camera again? Which hasn't really happened, if you've noticed. So, uh, my vlogging and chewing skills are getting better. Let me just say this. That interaction, that meet and greet with Gaston, was top notch. It was amazing. It was fabulous. Oh my gosh. But the funny thing, though, is in that picture, he made fun of my muscles and stuff, but 
I think I kind of look pretty decent with my muscle in that one picture with him. Eh, I don't know. But uh, maybe I'm tooting my own horn. Toot toot. Let's pay it forward. In our travels, uh, we've come across some vloggers, as you know, and uh, another group of vloggers, well, not group, another duo, I may say, a uh, guy and a girl, they call themselves The Flept. Yep, The Flept, F-L-E-P-T, and crazy name, I know this, but hey, so is this Jabbers, right? So who am I to criticize? They are one of the vloggers that we met up with. Sam and I actually went to Polynesian and met up with them. And let me just tell you this, they are truly sincere, fantastic, fabulous vloggers. They're Miami based and they do some amazing stuff. You have to check out their channel. When they do the outro, ooh, did I say they're gonna do the outro? I ruined the surprise. When they do the outro, I'm going to post their uh, Instagram and their channel on YouTube. Go check them out and subscribe. I can't say enough about them. They were such sweethearts. We ended up resort hopping on the monorail. We ended up watching fireworks with them. This is a vlog that's coming at some point. Don't you worry. This Jabber 71 got you. And then we were able to have something to eat in the Contempo Cafe. We had a fantastic time with them and I know I, I need to get some new adjectives amazing fantastic fabulous I gotta get some better words like yeah even better than pungent right Whew, okay so on that note I'm going to show you a couple of clips of the vlog that will be coming at some point and uh, then I'm gonna let them take it away uh oh uh oh! It's the flipped. Hi. Hi. Nice to finally meet you. Eileen Hi. and Jeremy. Sam. This is Sam. Hi. Nice to meet you. I'm Christian. I feel oh, like I'm gonna lay on you and everything. Right. <laughs> That's how we do it. Yeah. How you been, ma'am? I'll give you a hug before you leave. And you, you, my dear. Well, Come on, bring it in. Bring it in. All right. So stay tuned, Magic Kingdom Part 2 is coming, and I can't wait for November. Millennium Falcon. Okay, goosebumps. Uh, so Aileen, Aileen, not Eileen, Aileen and Jeremy, take it away. Dizjabber71 out. Hey, hey guys. guys, we're the Flep from Miami. And you just saw Diz Jabber go to Magic Kingdom, which is obviously one of the best parks in Disney World. Thank you so much for including us at the end of your video. And always remember to reach, reach for, for the, the sky. sky.